Shea Cole at the Mayweather Boxing Club. You know, we've seen you around the gym here a little while, but I don't know your story, man. Tell me a little bit about you. Uh, well, first, uh, uh, I started when I was really uh, little. I was six years old when I started. Uh, and I was a uh, world champion six times uh, as an amateur in kickboxing and Muay Thai. And at age 19, I decided to switch to boxing. Uh, uh, I just decided to switch, you know, and uh, I got 21 fights, I lost uh, five times early career, I beat some good fighter, I lost to some good fighters, okay. and that's about it. Where, the area you're from, man, tell me about it, like, you know, what's what's uh, it like? I'm, I, I'm, I'm Canadian, I'm from Montreal, Canada. Okay. Uh, I live right now in Las Vegas, I moved for my boxing career, it's much better over here, it's more focused for me. It's too much fun, even though Las Vegas people think it's fun, not really. It's Montreal where I was. It's too much fun for me, too much party, too much friends. You're so Montreal? I, yeah, oh, Montreal, yeah. Quebec, Canada, yeah. So I decided just to move to focus on my career. It's it's very tough for me to focus over there. Do you, you still know? go to Montreal? Very little, very little. I go visit sometime. When I go visit, I don't like to train over there. It's just. Their uh, boxing scene is blowing up up there. Have you been noticing that a little yeah, bit? Yeah, yeah. There is some very good fighters and this, but just very little. It's not compared to the US here. Okay. Honestly, if you want to make it in boxing, you must be here. Okay, now you moved to Los Angeles for a while at the wild yeah. card. Tell me your best memories from the wild card. Well, I was at wild card. I spoke with a lot of very, with a lot of What's up, Good fighter. I I, I'm not that person. I like to say that. it doesn't matter for me. It's yeah. Very good fighter. I I train with very good guys. I I, I met now the fans best. love hearing who names though. Like so, you spar Pacquiao and any other. I spar. I spar even Joe. Uh, uh, other than Pacquiao, I spar uh, what his name? Uh, uh, Karras. Soto, Soto Karras. Karras yeah. yeah. I spar with him uh, a lot. Actually, he's the most one. He's a uh, he's with him a lot. Like, I don't know how many rounds, maybe like 50 rounds oh, yeah. for his preparation for whatever they call Yeah, Keith uh, Thurman, he lost, but yeah. it was very tough sparring. And uh, yeah, I like it over there, it's very good. Okay. I, I decided to move here, I believe here, kind of better, you know. And hof honestly, hopefully, I get a shot and sparring. I'm talking, I don't want people to think I'm crazy. Hopefully, I get a shot and sparring with Floyd. I like sparring with Floyd, yeah. Okay, why, why Floyd? Because I believe he's the only one, like. It's ugly to say that, but I believe he's the only one better than me in everything. Yeah. <laughs> it's just, I want to be honest, he, you know, he, he is really, he, in my opinion, in my opinion, he is better than anybody, even Muhammad Ali, even Mike Tyson. Okay. Have you seen a lot of his sparring here? Just yeah, I look at his sparring. What do you think of his training camps? It's always pretty, pretty live. <laughs> I, mean, I mean, in his gym, um, probably if somebody here that you now they will hate me or maybe kick me out of the gym, that's okay. I really wasn't impressed with the guy this poor Floyd. They were like, they were good father who spoke Floyd, like, but I wasn't impressed, you know what I mean? Like, I don't know, I didn't like the guy spoke with Floyd, like Floyd. Amazing, and he beat he beat them so, but he looked impressive like crazy, you know. So the guys sparring with Floyd, I don't know, they're just okay, you know what I mean? What what keeps you busy in Las Vegas outside of boxing? Is there anything else? You just all about boxing? I just train two or three times a day and. Uh, is it takes on nothing, no boring. So, I don't do anything, and do that's why I moved here. What's the last time you fought in the ring? How long has it been? April twenty fifth. Of this year? This year. Yep. Okay, where was that fight? Uh, Wisconsin. Okay, you, yeah, you win? Yeah, I knocked the guy out first yeah. round. Oh, and I fought uh, February 7, I think. So you're staying Texas. busy then, yeah. that's good. Yeah. Who's guiding your career? Like, who are you uh, affiliated with? Uh, CFC Promotion, Chicago Fighter Club. Okay. Uh, they, they put me on a lot of fights. I fought for Mike Tyson in okay. February 7. He even tweeted about me, fight of the night, and ESPN. Good. Yeah. What? Got you. So, is it hard for you though, trying to like live this life? Because you know, being a fighter, trying to, it's not gonna work for everyone. That's just the harsh reality. You know, there's setbacks for some guys. It's, a, it's an uphill battle. Like, what tells you that you can be the one to break through? Honestly, this thing is the hardest thing in life. I tell you that uh, it's, it's nothing hard. I, I believe it. Dying, I, I believe dying. It's easier. It's very tough. You know, I, sometimes I hate my life. I hope. I hope 
I become world champion. I know it's tough. I know I lost five times in my life. But guess what? You know, I I was world champion as an amateur in kickboxing Muay Thai. I know, and that's not bullshit. You know? so I hope I do it. I'm working so hard. I lost five times because I'm stupid. Because I decide to like women and party and this and not focus on training. I hope I do it. I'm I'm, I, I won my last four fights by knockout. You know what I mean? So. Are you? How can fans reach out to you if they want to uh, learn more about you? I would like everybody add me, let's say, on Facebook. I don't have fan page, you know what I mean? I don't, uh, you know, they can follow my career on my fan, my, 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 my Facebook, you know what I mean? Uh, my name is Ahmad Cheko and uh, I don't have a fan page yet. I'm not a world champion. When I become world champion, I, be, I, I do a fan page, but I don't deserve it. I don't believe I deserve to have a fan page yet. You have to become world champion in this thing. That sounds good. Good luck to you. Man. Thank you so much. Now I'm back in the game, just trying to display my name. I'm open in my delivery, so deliver my pain. And I show what I know through paper and pencil. Cause I don't rap about swag, cause swag is for bitch show. Man, I thought you knew all the things that I've been through. So I'm retelling the story.